go by the name N Vibes. We are doing a little show right now, presenting uh, Brunor at Crown Melbourne, November the 4th. It's a historic moment. Uh, it's really maybe the biggest thing I've been a part of, just being able to structure it from the start, not just as a performer, but as a entrepreneur of the whole idea. So the opportunity kind of came one night when the homie Brandon, which is the whole manager of our uh, Generation Worldwide Web, linked up with uh, Cedric, uh, which runs the fashion brand Renault. He uh, just moved down here from the States to re-establish his brand. We kind of pitched the idea to Crown, they gave us the green light, and after that, our uh, ideas have just been constantly manifesting, and yeah, I feel like all the isolation that we did to in ensure that this event is going to run the way we uh, had, had the idea of it to run, is it's gonna be like, it's gonna happen. And I'm confident that we're all gonna bring it. Like, I really want you guys to just think about Melbourne and how far it's come in the last year, in the last three years. Just being a part of the scene and the industry and watching it grow and evolve into something of its own nature. And we're really about to be an iconic, iconic city for the whole fucking world right now. And like, it's big props to everybody doing some cool shit. Everybody that has a dream, fucking chase that. Don't let, don't sleep on yourself. Don't sleep on anybody around you. Support, uh, you know, help your friends. It's we are, we really a family, and I feel like for the whole world to evolve to the next step, it's the creatives that are gonna um, plant them seeds of ideas. <laughs> So, so who's your like, who's your icon? Who, who do you kind of look up to for inspiration when you're like, when you're thinking about? I can't pinpoint an exact person, but I can say that it's just um, basic things. Most people reach out to be inspired by that extra, extra things that happen, or they look, they look for inspiration. Or, but I'm kind of just inspired by shit that happens to me on an everyday basis. I might go for a walk and I might see a fucking uh, a couple birds, and the mother might be helping, like you know, the infant or something, and that to me just shows me the beautiful process of life the beautiful process of life itself and um yeah it's just little shit like that bro we could like think of this process this process itself inspires me our our capability inspires me um how far we've come in general has inspired me a lot of things inspire me bro it's hard to kind of pinpoint it to one person by all means there has been some cool people doing some cool shit though Shout out you want to give? Yeah, bro. Shout out to Generation Worldwide Web. Shout out to Brandon, the owner of Generation Worldwide Web. Shout out to the Off the Grid family, Craigie Wave, Shiona, Brandon, myself. Shout out to everybody in Melbourne doing some cool fucking shit. Shout out to you, bro. Like, fuck. Shout out everybody in this whole building. Shout out to Homie Savage, the girl. Shout out to uh, the alternatives uh, run by Juliet. Shout out to everybody doing some cool fucking shit. Shout out. It's love, and I love you all for helping Melbourne become what it's about to we're about to make a statement and it's fucking love yeah all right now i'm gonna get that mark off you yeah bro say no Bye. more here you Stay go stay safe bro hope, hope it kills it yeah where i will now to yeah you should everybody should be here right now like i said this is a fucking historic moment yo yeah. love change this is what i came for people at the same store rocking on the same fit just face it you